Okay, so I finally set up my um, little scrapbook area here and I'm going to create a sample spread for my market so that way people will know what stickers can be used for, especially my photo stickers. They look at them but they don't really know exactly what to use it for. <laughs> done with that um i only did like one side because it just took so long and i'm too lazy to do the other side so yeah i think one side is good enough <laughs> So I 
just made my coffee. It's already so late in the day. It's like one o'clock already. It's because I woke up, got ready for the day, and then I made lunch. And then, yeah, time just got away from me. And then I just made a post. So last night I ordered um, a few more things to update my market display. The arch displays that I currently have. The problem with those is that it, although it is portable, it is very fragile. And with my bins and my trolley in the car, I have to be very careful. Um, and like it can easily be dented and, and it's just not I ideal for me and also like if it rains or if it snows um, it's automatically going to get onto the displays now with the income that I receive from my markets I can finally buy better displays so it's not coming in until Friday but once they do come in I'll kind of uh, walk you through how I'm going to set it up alright I finally got it let's fill this Ooh. Okay, so this is a lot thinner than a regular like wooden or metal pegboard. It's made out of polypropylene. I hope I'm saying that right. Thinner, but still pretty sturdy. So I'm gonna build it and hopefully my stickers will stay on there because um, it's gonna be standing up like this. So we'll see. Doesn't seem like it bends easily. Maybe I should have opened it nicely in case it doesn't work out. Let's see. Whatever. It feels like a acrylic material. All right, so we'll do one side first and see how it looks. So I'm gonna have them stand up vertically, like this. did like the L's in the back. I think with the L's it'll add some support to the back so that way it doesn't like wobble so much. And then those uh, metal parts I think I might bend it in but then again there's still this gap over here. To be continued. The wing nuts that I got from Amazon did not fit these. So I went to Menards today to get these wing nuts specifically for these kinds of screws or this size. So hopefully that is the right one. Um, and then I know this is super ghetto, but I used like super old socks and then I had some like rocks. So I just like threw them in there to add as weight because I did not consider that this might tip over. I think in the meantime, I'm probably gonna do this. I really wished the T clamps worked for this because then I wouldn't have to carry more weight. Praying that these work. This new display does require a little more time to set up, but it saves so much more space compared to my old displays. I'm able to lay out other products in front of these displays, and you'll see that later on. Okay, I did some thinking. I think I'm just gonna get clamps, so that way I can clamp this part and the, um, the edge of the table together. I think that she'll do it. Here it is. I think this leaves enough for space to
this. I don't have to carry anything by hand anymore. Everything fits. <laughs> Thanks for pointing it out. <laughs> Beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, we are done setting up and we have we still have about 30 minutes left. Alex got me all mic'd up because he wants to record me talking. <laughs> oh, I can help. Still have like 12 minutes. Before I start, didn't you uh, receive emails or text it to you? you text. Sure. I think it already has you on there. Perfect. Thank you so much. Now, if you had a graduation card, I would be all set. Oh. <laughs> I only have like a congratulations one. That's like the only one that I have. Uh, yeah. Just these two cards today? Yeah. All right. And you can have cash your card. I thought you have cash. Oh, do you need a do you need a bag for that? Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. I just sold two of my Mother's Day cards, one of each design. Woo! It's only been 22 minutes. I also didn't mention this earlier, but um, one of the other vendors bought an art print earlier around 10:30, so it was like before everybody started coming. The sticker version of that one. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh I thought it was a postcard. <laughs> Those are photo oh, stickers. Beautiful. This is how I usually use them, like scrapbooking style. Yeah. Thank you. And I do have the photo prints on this side. We're doing pretty well. Still haven't made back the market fees yet, but I think soon we will. I'm hoping so. We'll see. <laughs> Do you need a bag? Um, that would be wonderful. Thank you. Are you paying with cash or card? Um, so it's my first time putting the socials up here, and there are people who are actually using it. I think three people used it so far, um, but. Yeah, that was like the first time that anybody has ever even used it, so I'm really glad that they are using it. So I'm really liking this setup, this new setup here. Another thing that I've been doing is uh, I've been like switching out some of the uh, photos to the front. I'm just trying to capture different people's attention and I think this is helping me so far. I'm really glad that I have different stuff. I think I'm getting some guys' attention as well. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm from uh, upstate New York. Oh really? Oh wow! I shot I shot this one um, at Whiteface Mountain up in oh, yeah. Whiteface is awesome, guys. Yeah, so. I, I didn't even, I didn't even hike it. I drove up there. Yeah, no, it's, <laughs> it's really long. <laughs> okay. Do you need a bag? Uh, sure. Right, thank you so much. Thanks so much. Hey you. I challenge you to make one new friend. When you leave here today. I already made two friends today. Okay, make another one. <laughs> Sorry, 
sorry, a customer came by. But basically, um, for between 12.30 to 1.30, I only got like one sale. And then I had like a mini rush, like with, at like 1.40 or so, something like that. Um, so I've been like getting it like a sale like here and there, but it's not that crazy, busy. What? How soft is this? I don't know. Damn. Let me know down in the comments below and I can consider doing that in the future. But yeah, once I get home, I'll show you guys what I've got from other small businesses. Hello, I am back. I just took an hour long nap. Now I feel so much better. I'm going to show you what I got. So I got this super simple and minimalistic card from Ivy Letter, which is perfect because I needed one for next month anyways. And then I got these super, super adorable mini prints from Lavender Chai Co. They are absolutely so adorable and so my vibe. And then I've been meaning to get magnets. I thought this one is super, super cute. I feel so bad. I don't have this person on social media, um, but it seems like it says B. Elson, so I'll have to go look that up. And then I got these super simple earrings. Um, I feel like I don't have many simple earrings that I can wear every day, and I don't have many black ones either. So I thought this one was perfect for everyday wear. This is from Cindy Wu. And last but not least, I got this tranquility candle from La Sauve, and it smells so good. I normally don't like sweet candles, um, but this one isn't too overwhelming and I think it's just like the perfect amount of sweetness. So yeah, I can't wait to use it. I'm actually going to use it right now. So that is all guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this market vlog. I'm trying not to be too repetitive each market vlog, but I hope you guys liked my new setup. And if you guys haven't seen my previous market vlogs, I do have a whole entire playlist dedicated to my market vlogs. So make sure to go check that out. But yeah, if you like this video, make sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe for future content similar to this and to follow me on my journey as a stationary business owner and in my next studio vlog i plan to do some bookmark design and i'll be making them for the first time ever so make sure you guys come back all right guys i'll see you guys next time bye